and welcome to wrestling and welcome to your Smackdown synopsis video for the WWE Smackdown Live episode from January 22nd. We kick off again with Becky Lynch. She's leading the line for Smackdown. Yep. Massive applause and chants and she's so over and we've been saying this for about four months now. Yeah. Uh, she has to main event WrestleMania. She yeah. comes out and says that she wants to main event it and, and it's got to happen. She's, it's the... It's the main thing. You'd think it'd be Rousey, Charlotte and her show. Do you think it's going to be a triple threat? Yeah, it has But to. I was wondering, right, because this is going to lead into our predictions video, which is coming out. Yeah. Where does that leave the SmackDown title picture? Because you've only really got Naomi and Carmella to take on Asuka. Well. And Carmella's probably still... I know she's had the belt, but she's... What if someone from Raw wins the Rumble and decides mm, to challenge well Asuka? I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, Asuka comes out. She's shouting in Becky's face. Like Sh she, yeah, she's shouting in Japanese, isn't she? As yeah, well. yeah, yeah. She's always shouting in Japanese. Yeah, what? Um, Charlotte joins them. She gives a, a promo about how she'll win the Rumble. And any of the choices, whether it be Sasha, yeah. Ronda, Becky, or Asuka, she's beaten the lot. So she's confident that she can uh, she can do whatever she wants, basically. Um, Asuka jumps Becky. They brawl outside with Becky coming out on top and walking away. Next. Yeah, that was it. Naomi and Mandy. <laughs> it was great. <laughs> it wasn't, it was pretty shit. There's a ref spot that ends the match and it was a weird one and Sonya well, then helped That's what I was saying on Raw though. Same on Smack... <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Same as on um, Smackdown. We've got loads of dodgy... Raw. Yeah, on Raw. Just dodgy finishes and that. Mm. What, but even this, on? like this, wasn't executed very well no, either. It wasn't, was it? No. So, yeah, grim. No one. Uh, Mandy wins. Yeah, no one really cares about that. Ray is cutting a promo backstage. I haven't watched it yet, you know. Have you not? No. So you're gonna have to lead that. Oh, I'll lead this. Basically, Ray is backstage giving a promo, and he's just pretty much like you said, doing what everybody else says. I'm gonna win the rumble. At I didn't least, even realise he's in the Rumble. At least he has the background of winning in 2006 yeah, to play he's, off. he's winning it. But basically, he just says that, I'm going to win the Royal Rumble, and later on tonight, he's going to teach Andrade a thing or two about respect. And Zelina a, is banned. Yeah, she's not allowed ringside. It's going to be a two out of three falls. Which I have not watched yet, so... Adam's going to have to tell you, you all about it. shall be disappointed. Now. Well, I heard that the ending is bad. Yes. Well, I personally think it is, but you might not. But anyway, the um, the next bit, our boys, who, are they going to win on Sunday? Are they not going to win on Sunday? <sighs> I think they're going to win. Miz and Shane head to the ring. Um, they're just chatting shit, basically. <laughs> Literally, it is just chatting shit. Miz is facing Cesaro. He's if you yeah. took on Sheamus the week before. Yeah, so Miz goes one-on-one -on -one with um, Cesaro. Not oh, there was a cool bit, though. Yeah. Cesaro plucks Miz out in midair, and he does a backbreaker. That yeah. bit was cool. Not a very good... Corey um, on form again as well, by the way. Mm, I Miz is in a bad match. mood, because Marine Six didn't get nominated <laughs> for an Oscar. I didn't make much of the match, but... No, it wasn't. Um, basically, Cesaro sort of interfered, and... No, Sheamus. Uh, yeah, sorry. Sheamus interfered, which cost Miz the match. Mm -hmm. Cesaro wins with the neutraliser. Yes. And then afterwards, they sort of jump in Shane back. Um, on the Shane, yeah, it was, Out, on they all just started brawling. Yeah. Didn't they? And did you see when Miz sort of crawled out because they were beating him up you should have seen this broad kick by the way it's yeah it's stiff ass yeah C Cesaro like sort of grabbed him so he couldn't move and held his face like yeah. that and then Seamus did the broad kick and it probably like like snaps him right in the face yeah, so it was yeah, stiff it looked bad I put that it was one of the stiffest broad kicks I've ever um, seen and then you sort of see Miz crawling yeah. around the ring and he just dives on top of him to stop yeah, him yeah he shields him doesn't he doesn't really work because the power they're bomb they're like putting both on the well they put Shane onto the thing, as it no, they put the Miz onto the thingy yeah. and then power bomb Shane through. onto the Miz and yeah. both through the announcement, which was pretty, that was pretty, all right, yeah, it was pretty cool to be fair. That yeah, little, that, was um, cool. that little bit, but yeah, Shane took one hell of a broke kick, yeah, it was bad, it looked, looked like it hurt. 
This bit, next bit I liked actually, um, was there was a video promo and it was like totally different. It was just like Ali was out somewhere and he was like giving it all, like, you know, I'm the heart and soul yeah. and all that. But it was like in a different environment. Like, I like it when they do things a little bit differently. A bit different to what we've seen. Yeah. yeah. And he was saying, like, you could tell from Samoa Joe's eyes that something, you know, something had snapped. Yeah. I, I think it was pretty cool. Mm. I'd like to see more things like that. If yeah, they, if they could, because they're good at producing these little video packages. Yeah. It's one thing they that WWE have always been good Vince at. Vince is back on screen anyway now. Yeah, again. he's sort of watching the end of Miz and Shane and that. Didn't wasn't watching TV like a mong. <laughs> like yeah. the rest of them all have to look at it like yeah. this. Yeah, he's just sort of stood he there just watching. stood looking at it. Well, why does everyone else have <laughs> to do it? Everyone watches TV like, like yeah. that. Yeah, Vince is just watching it normally. Yeah, but. Then he comes to the ring anyway and gets um, this bit was good. he gets Styles out and he gets Brian out, but Daniel Bryan won't go into the ring because yeah. he doesn't want to get beaten up or for whatever reason. Um, Vince starts shouting him like a yeah he teacher, does he's like, get in the ring get in the ring now Daniel like get in the ring. <laughs> <laughs> um, AJ goes on about oh, he goes on about being all this. Um, world protector and that and he's like oh well how did you get here you took a plane like the rest of us yeah, so you're yeah. not perfect. Um, and then AJ decides, oh, you know what? If he's not going in the ring, I'll go out of the ring. Mm-hmm. Um, they sort of have a bit of a brawl until AJ goes and hit the phenomenal forearm, and Daniel Bryan gets Vince, pushes him in front of him. So as Styles gets down, stops to know. Yeah, he's like, oh, damn it. Gets down, and Bryan hits the running knee. Danny Bryan's really good as a heel. Yeah, he is. I like that running knee move as well. I always like He's it. He's killing it in this current thing. Yeah. He's good. Um, he was celebrating on top of the ramp and everything. It yeah. Was so cowardly. And then the next bit was good. Yeah. With Carmella and our truth. Our <laughs> truth's going on about um, if he wins the Royal Rumble from number thirty, he doesn't want to face Brock Lesnar. Yeah, that was funny. <laughs> because he don't want to go. What does he say? He for, messed it up, didn't yeah, he? Yeah, he don't want to go to. I can't remember. Sir, I can't remember. Sir Flex City. Yeah, he messed it up. Yeah, and then yeah. Carmella goes, It's Suplex City. It's Suplex City. And he's like, I don't want to go there either. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was good. Oh, Archie has been good in this little run, hasn't he? He is funny, to be fair. Yeah, he's really good. Apparently, Vince McMahon loves him. He thinks he's proper funny. I bet he does, yeah. yeah. He's, he's sort of humour, isn't yeah. he? Vince is real I'm, childlike. I'm humor. still saying that R Truth is going to come out 30th in the Women's Rumble. You think still? I think on. so. It's funny. <laughs> yeah, it's oh. good. Yeah, I think that will probably happen. And, yeah, uh, and Carmella will like run out and like yeah. shove him to one side, isn't he? Like, got, like, oh, it's not this one. Mm. You're in the wrong one. Yeah. Well, so that, apparently the women's is that, gonna be on before the men's. Yeah, for that's yeah, what so, yeah. that, that would have to be the case. Yeah. Um, but then Charlotte is saying that because she wasn't in, was she last year? No, Charlotte wasn't in. Yeah. The Rumble. Yeah. So Carmella is giving her like advice. Yeah. Well, that was quite funny. But yeah, little. I'm enjoying the Carmella and our truth. I am as well. And, th- and as we've said a million times, I think Carmella's enjoying it. Yeah. She looks like she's having fun. But she loved working with Ellsworth as well, she said. Yeah. So. She seems to just get on well with everybody, basically. Yeah. Next up is Samoa Joe versus Mustafa Ali. Yep. Um. Didn't really make much of it other than Ali got jumped before the bell and Joe just dominated mm. the match, pretty mm. much dominated the match. Ali manages to get a little bit of separation. He turns yeah. the tables for a bit, goes for the 0-5-4. Joe stops him and he locks in the clutch. Yeah. And he wins. I like that the clutch has sort of become this massive yeah, destructive it, it weapon good, again. Yeah, it is good, isn't it? Once you're in it, that's it's it. It's one step back to getting some old Joe, like, back up there for me. Yeah, And uh, hopefully. The clutch really is, at the minute, it seems to be just destroying everyone yeah so good good stuff in that sort of sense but yeah yeah again, none of the matches were particularly memorable no and then but we, I, you know it's a weekly show we got a, gonna be. no you got to tell me about the main event because i still have got not a little seen backstage it. segment before the main event okay with the new day nice um which was quite cool they were um sort of plotting what Kofi, How are they going to do it? What Kofi's going to do in, oh, the, right. in the match this yeah, year. Yeah, because that's become a thing, hasn't it? Yeah. yeah. Which Kofi does something random every single year. Yeah. So, what will he do this year? 
He's running out of things to do. I though. think he's going to stand on a pancake. Didn't we say that last year though? Maybe we did. What are they promoting now? Is it pancakes? I, I don't know. know. We're doing pancakes and they stopped for like two weeks and then they did them again. I'm not sure. It'd be interesting anyway. Didn't, didn't didn't we say some? Didn't he do that last year? I can't remember what he did last year now. There was one where he like landed on the ring on the last ring year's post. wasn't very good. That was last year's where he was on the actual post and someone like swiped was his feet. Was that last year? Yeah, and he like jumped and like I've landed watched, on his like thing. I think I've watched two since they've come back. That was one of them. He was on. Um, I can't remember. No, I'll have to look at it. One of them, Biggie caught him. And yeah. then he jumped on two thingies back I and jumped in. Did they not use pancakes last year? I don't think I can't so. remember. I don't know. Maybe right. they did. Anyway. Anyway, the main event time, which was Ray versus... So, I haven't seen it, but for me, these two have had two absolute stellar matches in the past two weeks. Yeah. In the past three weeks. And it, it was good, basically. You remember their match from... Um, last week very similar to that a lot of similar spots yeah. um, sort of like hurricane runners there was quite a lot of flippy like flippy stuff mm. Mysterio did that move again which we don't really know the name yeah, of yeah he's like a pile driver but he like yeah. flips round yeah, yeah. It's, oh, it's amazing Andrade did his sort of power bomb thing that I he think, does I think you'll only ever see like them two do that though maybe someone yeah. like Mustafa Ali could probably put um, as well and then Ray goes 1-0 up um, Ray sort of dominates the first bit wins one Andrade the second bit hits his finisher wins one and it's tied up one all like really good match I won't like spoil too much of it if you haven't no, seen no, it but crack on like I say it's just, it's just it is just what the match was last week a really good match both hitting the finishes both hitting the cool moves and then as it is one all Samoa Joe comes down with a mic and says oh I told you, this is what I'm going to do to everybody in the rumble. Goes down, lays waste to them both. And right. just before that, just before you think, oh, the show's going to go off air. He's just beating them both down, cooking a clutch, standing there tall. Randy Orton, out of nowhere, RKO. And that's it. That is the end. And you're just thinking, what? Like, what? That, is a, that sounds like, where, so yeah. weird. Randy Orton. Where did he come from? Hasn't done anything in a while. Then oh, no. hits Joe with the RKO and weird. And the fans were buzzing with it. But, yeah, but you know it's the moves over. I know, isn't it? But it's like that is weird. That does sound weird. But it, I don't know. And that was that was it. That was the end of the. I'd have liked show. to see the match finish, but there's rumours that pay per view they're gonna have um, gone to the Rumble and finish it there. So, oh. But it was really good, and if it's if they do do a rumble match, it'll be um, it'll be interesting to see if they can, because they are having good matches, aren't they? Yeah. Like, like I say, this was really good. We pretty much got all the moves that we've we've seen in the yeah, last. Yeah, I'm one. enjoying seeing him um, wrestle. But so I can't really do. Like it. I say, uh, I'm not a fan of Joe coming out and ruining him, and then Randy Orton out of nowhere. Yeah, no, just out, which, bizarre. Yeah, but what um, can you do? So I can't really give a score because I've not seen it all, so you have to leave it up to you. I'm going to give it a five, slightly better than Raw, but not very good for a go-home show, I don't think. Mm -hmm. So, four or five. There you are then. We will see you in our Royal Rumble content. Mm. It's coming. It's Rumble Week. <laughs>